Well, we just watched the Grammys. A lot of stars there, of course. A lot of public figures make money off their looks and personalities, but we found one who's now accused of romancing women out of tens of thousands of dollars. Chief investigative reporter Morgan Lowe tells us about the TV wilderness guide who left a trail of broken hearts and empty wallets across the country. I go by Todd the Wilderness Man Justice. I have been in this industry for 30 years. I was His name is Todd Justice. He is a wilderness expert. He's heard the call of the wild. Who's been featured on the Discovery Channel in magazines. So your name? Good morning, Todd Justice. Todd, nice how are you? Jamie. Even on our sister TV station, 3TV. One of the biggest mistakes people make is leaving their vehicle. But we found another less flattering description of this wilderness man. I just think that he's after to use women. Tina says she met Justice in an online dating service. Quite the gentleman. Uh, very interested in what was going on with me. But soon, she says, he asked her for a loan. How much did he ask you for? Uh, 10000 So what happened after you gave him the money? Um, he kind of disappeared. We heard similar stories from women across the country, from San Francisco to Phoenix to a small town in Illinois. I actually grew up with Todd in Crete, Illinois. Deb says Justice reached out to her on Facebook. I put up a, a picture on Valentine's Day and he said, Oh my God, you have the most beautiful lips I've ever seen in my life. Soon she says he was asking her for money. Come to find out I was not the only by that point. $16,000 of mine. Text messages and social media posts share similar stories from multiple women. Sweet message from Justice, desperate plea for repayment from the women. Down there was a stack of uh, receipts for electronic transfers of me, which were made out to Justice. James Lawton says Justice took $11,000 from his wife. Join me on my adventure and I'll show you a little bit about my lifestyle. This we reached out to Justice in an effort to get his side of the story. After agreeing to sit down with us, he canceled and sent us this message. I have owned the fact I was in a bad spot and borrowed money and have been making payments and am working daily at restitution of any debtors I may have. I filed the lawsuit against him and um, I've received nothing. Tina and the others say at this point, they just want to warn people about justice. If I can help someone uh, and prevent this from happening to them, this is why I'm here. Todd Justice's website had a biography page that claimed he graduated from ASU and wrestled there. We checked with the school and they say they have no record of him attending. That biography page has since been taken down. If you want to see more of our exclusive investigations, 